You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. The East Kentucky Community Remembrance Project and the Big Sandy Chapter of Kentuckians for the Commonwealth will be hosting a free community lunch and service project Saturday, May 27th in Wayland, Kentucky. The project is working to clear brush from a cemetery where many black residents, including some who were enslaved people, are buried. The Remembrance Project, um, Mr. Shannon was lynched in, uh, in that area uh, where we're having the Remembrance Project at in Wayland, Kentucky uh, tomorrow. Um, as a black man, of course, you know, he was lynched in Floyd County and um, we're celebrating him and making sure that his story doesn't die out. Um, there's an old liquor store that used to be the jail. Um, it's still there. Um, we're wanting to collect soil samples from there to preserve that and to partner up with the Equal Justice Institute uh, to preserve uh, Mr. Shannon's story. So it's forever told. Um, it's really great. It's history. Uh, it's our history. History that needs to be told. History that needs to be preserved for future generations. Uh, Everyone is welcome, even if you are unable to help clear brush. All volunteers must be 16 years or older. Coming from my perspective as a black man, of course, is uh, preserving our history so our kids can know these things. Because, uh, you know, after so long, sometimes the stories don't get passed down the way they should be, and that history can be forgotten. So having projects like the Remembrance Project keeps that history alive and uh, it keeps it going for future generations of people who may not even know about it. A lot of the time with history, only the good things are highlighted. You know, the bad stuff is usually buried and hidden. Um, with bringing this history to the forefront, it's bringing more awareness, it's bringing more empathy, um, especially to the, our region. It's letting people know these things did happen here. You know, we need to acknowledge these things and they want to change things. They're wanting to um, really, really get a better understanding on who they are and how things like this has shaped our region. Um, so it's all about education and educating people is one way to break a cycle. And that's what we're all about. The work project will begin at 9.30 a.m. at the Wayland Community Center. Lunch will be held from 12.30 p.m. to 3 p.m. For more information, go to the Big Sandy Chapter of Kentuckians for the Commonwealth on Facebook. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.